What's good, beer fam? This is Big Tone coming at you from Big Tone Productions, Beats and Feast. You know what time it is. It's time for another cooking video, and today we're going to do a creamy lemon pepper chicken and orzo pasta. Sounds like a lot, but don't be intimidated. Real simple, one pot meal. So if you like the video, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Turn on your post notifications. Make sure you share the video. Let's get started with some creamy lemon pepper chicken and orzo pasta. So my supporting cast is as follows. Of course, we got my chicken here. I got chicken breasts. I got three of them cut up into cubic, into little small one inch cubes, I would say. They're about one inches. And then my vegetables. I got an onion cut up here, a little bit of celery, and I got some scallions for garnish, and I'm gonna put a little bit in the recipe itself. Spices, salt and pepper to taste, a little parsley, some lemon pepper seasoning, um, a little bit of rosemary, of course my garlic, can't leave home without it. And then I'm gonna be adding chicken broth to it. I got some sour cream, a little bit of Parmesan cheese, and of course you can't have orzo pasta without the orzo pasta. We got some orzo pasta. Orzo pasta looks like rice, um, but it is a pasta. Um, I love it. It's somewhat a little hard to find. Some grocery stores don't have it, but you can get it at most. But uh, and that's one pound of pasta, and then I got a little bit of heavy cream here. Oh, and some mushrooms. I'm sorry, we got mushrooms to go in there too. So that's all the ingredients. I'm gonna also add a little bit of lemon, um, fresh lemon, to go with the, my lemon pepper. But uh, we'll get to that when we start putting it together. Other than that, let's get it started. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna throw in my onion and my celery. Onion goes in the pan. We're gonna saute, saute these up. And then my celery's gonna go in. And I'll add a little bit of fresh onion here. A little, little scallion in there. All right, so we're gonna let this cook down. Get it nice and translucent, translucent. Let some of the juices come out and the waters come out of the, the onion. And then we'll add our mushrooms to it, and we'll get started on um, seasoning that up. All right, so the onions and the celery's cooking down a little bit. Onion's starting to get a lot, a lot more translucent. So I'm gonna start seasoning this up a little bit. I'm gonna use about a teaspoon of garlic using minced garlic and a little bit of salt and pepper to taste you gotta season your vegetables too guys a little salt here's a little pepper you gotta keep that moving you don't want the garlic to burn but we're not gonna Keep it that long here. Ah, yeah, I can smell the garlic now. Woo, smells good, guys. Smells good. If anybody knows how to make smell a vision, let me know so we can go on a partnership and both be rich. All right, so our onions and celery is cooking down there. I'm going to go ahead and add my chicken. Like I said, I got three chicken breasts there cut up into cubes. And I'm gonna add now some of my lemon pepper seasoning. I'm gonna add a pinch of salt to the chicken. Some 
some rosemary. Add just a tad bit more lemon pepper seasoning. There we go. Gonna add a smidgen of parsley here for now. All right, and so to get that continue cooking, I'm gonna add about two tablespoons, two two tablespoons of butter. Let that melt down in there. Keep that chicken moist. We are using chicken breast. Right. Yeah, chicken breast. So we're gonna let that cook until that chicken is cooked all the way through. Then we'll add the rest of our ingredients there. Right, the chicken is almost done. Right when it gets to about this point, I'm gonna squeeze in some lemon juice. Some fresh lemon juice there. Gonna mix this up a little bit more and let it cook probably another two minutes or so that all the pieces get fully cooked. Guys, the chicken is cooked all the way through now. And so the next thing I'm gonna add to it is my mushrooms. Now, mushrooms are 99% water, so it's going to put out a little bit more liquid here. We're going to let those cook just a little bit, probably about three or four minutes. And then we'll start adding our liquids to it. I'm going to throw in another pinch of salt here, guys. All right, we're gonna let those mushrooms cook for a little bit, and then we'll start adding our liquids in our, our pasta. We're gonna add four cups of chicken broth. It's 32 ounces to this. Let me stir this up just a little bit. And now we're gonna add our orzo pasta. It's one pound. We're gonna stir this in, make sure all the rice is covered with some liquid. All right, we're gonna bring that to a simmer. It's gonna take a few minutes, and then we'll start adding our creams to it. But let's bring this to a simmer here first. Right, guys, it's been cooking for about three or four minutes. Rice is start or the rice. The orzo is starting to really cook. So I'm gonna add my heavy cream to it. <clears throat> ah yeah, there we go. And I'm gonna add my sour cream to it now. This is 16 ounces of sour cream. I'm gonna use about eight ounces in there, about half of it. Let that melt up in there. Ooh, it's gonna be good. Kind of stir this up a little bit. Oh uh, yeah, so let's let that melt a little bit. I'll be back here in just a moment. All right guys, at the last minute, I decided to add some sweet peas to this. Just a little bit I had in the freezer. I'm just gonna add those, just a little bit there in the mix. 
stir those up just a little bit in there. I didn't tell you about that in the supporting cast because I just thought about it. Little sweet peas. Now I'm gonna add my Parmesan cheese to it. We're gonna stir that up in there. That's gonna add as a good thickener. Orzo is almost done. Gonna let that cook for about another five minutes and we'll be ready to plate it up for you. Look at that guys, look how creamy this is. Ooh, Lord. Oh man, that's so, smells so good. Let me plate this up for you. Lemon pepper and chicken orzo pasta. One pot meal on the stove top. Can't get much easier than that guys. You know what I'm waiting for. I'm waiting for that bite. Let me get it. Here you go. Lemon pepper chicken and orzo pasta dish. Can't get much easier than that. Real simple, real quick. You know what I'm waiting for. I'm waiting for that bite. It's hot, guys. It's real hot. Mm. Oh, man. Hey guys, on a cold winter day, this will set you right. I am I'm not kidding you. You gotta try this. This is awesome. Hey, hey, if you like the video, do me a favor. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, make sure you share the video. And hey, this is Big Tone signing off. Peace.